हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू फार्मा रॉक्स यूट्यूब चैनल फार्मा रॉक्स द वे ऑफ सक्सेस इज द यूट्यूब एजुकेशन चैनल विच प्रोवाइड यूज द वीडियोस ऑन वेरियस कॉम्पिटेटिव एग्जाम्स रिलेटेड टू फार्मेसी लाइक द जी पैट नाइपर डी आई एंड फार्मासिस्ट एग्जाम इन टूडेज वीडियो वी विल स्टडी अबाउट द एब्रीवेशंस इन ए प्रिस्क्रिप्शन सो एन एक्सपर्ट लेक्चर बाय मिस्टर अमर रावल ऑन एब्रीवियशंस इन ए prescription so let's start about the abbreviations so uh, in the abbreviations in a prescription we saw the various abbreviations are written in a prescription and we don't know about the meaning of that abbreviations and a short form so let's learn about this so first one it is a ana okay it is a ana and its meaning is a of each e n a of each its meaning is a each second one is a triple a triple a it means apply to affected area a means apply second a means affected third a is a area so uh, apply to affected area abdominal erotic aneurysm okay abdominal erotic aneurysm it's a latin term third one is a ac AC it means antisebum. AC means antisebum, and its meaning is a before meals. Antisebum before meals. S E A C H S. It means antisebum at hora somi. Antisebum at hora somi. It means before meals and at bedtime. Before meals and at a bedtime. so let's check the next abbreviations next is the ed ed it means oris dextra oris dextra meaning right ear its meaning is a right ear next is the ed and add okay not uh, not the full stop at the uh, middle but the full stop at the end so it means a add a editor it means add let there to be added next is the am am means ante meridium ante meridium it means the morning or before noon before noon then emp emp it means ampulla ampulla it means a ampules okay amp it means a ampules ampulla and ampules next is the eq eq it means a aqua eq it means a aqua aqua it means it is a water next is eq bull eq bull it means aqua bollens aqua bollens the meaning is a boiling water then eq com eq c o m abbreviation it means aqua communis aqua communis and its meaning is a common water next is the aqua dest it means aqua destillata and the meaning is a distilled water next abbreviations are a dot l dot and a dot s dot it means oris liva and oris sinistra oris liva and oris sinistra and its meaning is a left ear next is au or is ultrac or is ultra it means both the ears bds b dot d dos s bis di sumendum bis di sumendum it means twice a daily twice a daily bis it means bis in sumendum it means twice bis it means a twice and bis di sumendum it means twice daily these are the very important bis ind it means twice a day bis in 7d it means bis in septum diverse it means twice a week twice a week bp phbr it means a pharmacopoeia britannica it means britain british pharmacopoeia 
बी एस इट मीन्स से ब्लड शुगर बी एस इट मीन्स ब्लड शुगर देन नेक्स्ट इज द बी डी बी टी बी टी इट मीन्स द बेड टाइम नेक्स्ट इज बी यू सी सी डॉट इट मीन्स ब्यूका एंड ब्यूका इट मीन्स ए बकल इन साइड द चिक सी एम एस इट इज इम्पोर्टेंट वन इट मीन्स ए क्रास माने सुमेंडस क्रास माने सुमेंडस एंड द मीनिंग इज ए टू बी टेकन टू मोरो मॉर्निंग टू बी टेकन टू मोरो मॉर्निंग इट्स एब्रीवेशन इज ए सी एम एस क्रास माने सुमेंडस द नेक्स्ट इम्पोर्टेंट इज ए सी आई पी सी आई पी इट मीन्स ए सी बस एंड सी बस का जो मीनिंग है वो है फूड Here are the most importance like the C dot C dot, it means a come sibo, come sibo. It means the with food. C n cross nocte, C means cross n means nocte. Cross nocte it means tomorrow night. C a p it means capiate. It means let him take or let the patient take. Next important one it is a C v. C dot V dot and it means a cross vesper and the meaning is a tomorrow evening. This one is the very important one. First one is a cochlear C O C H L coch and its Latin full form is a cochlear and the meaning is a spoonful. Meaning is a spoonful. Next one is a coch E M P L. It means Cochlear amplum, cochlear amplum, and its meaning is a a tablespoon full, but a small tablespoon full. Next one is a coch infant. It means cochlear infantis, and the meaning is a a teaspoon full. Third one is cochlear magnum, cochlear magnum. It means a tablespoon full, but a large cochlear modicum cochlear modicum it means a dessert spoonful and the last one cochlear parvum cochlear parvum it is a teaspoonful so this table is a very important many times the questions were asked from this table so let's check the next one it is a dl d5 lr it means dextrox 5% in a lactate rinser solution it is a intravenous sugar solution dlr or d5 lr it means dextrose 5% lactate rinser solution used for intravenous sugar solution the next is d5 ns D5 it means dextrose five percent and NS it means normal saline. It is the zero point five percent concentration of the normal saline. So intravenous sugar solution containing zero point nine percent sodium chloride. Third one is a D5W or D5W. It is a dextrose five percent in a water. Dextrose five percent is a Water intravenous sugar solution and D ten W it is a dextrose in a ten percent water. So D five, D five, D ten it means dextrose five percent, dextrose ten percent. But L R it means lactated ringer solution. N S it means normal saline. W it means a water. Okay. Let's check the next one. Next abbreviations are G A R G dot. It means Gargarisma and gargarisma it means a gargle. They are similar to the mouthwash. Next one is a gr dot. It means granum and its meaning is a grain. Third one is the very important ask many times in a competitive exam. It is a gudt dot. It means a gutta or gutte and its meaning is a drop or a drops. Drop or drops. The short term H or HR or HOR it means a hora, and hora it means a hour. Okay. 
Next one is a fiat pillula. Fiat it means a make and pillula it means a pill. So fiat pillula it means a make a pill. Next one is a f dot m dot it means fiat mistura and its meaning is a, a make a mixture. Let's check the next about the injections. It is a I J I N J it means a injectio it means a injection. I M it means a intramuscular. I N it means a intranosal. I D it means a intradermal. And I F N it means infusion. It is a infusion mainly given in a intravenous infusion. Let's check the next one. It is a L dot b okay so it is a libra lb dot libra and its meaning is a pound lin it means a linimentum and the meaning is a liniment iq it means liquor and liquors means solution lot dot it means lotio and english is a lotion then last one is a very important m dot d dot u it is a more dicto utendus more dicto utendus it means to be used as directed to be used as directed next abbreviations are mit dot or mi double t it means mitte and mitte it means a sand MEQ it means milliequivalent, MCG it means a microgram, MANE it means in the morning and NOCTE it means at night. MANE it means morning and NOCTE it means a night. So uh, based on that OM it means a omni hora or uh, sorry omni MANE it means a every morning. Omni it means a every and mane it means a morning so o dot m dot it means a every morning omni mane every morning then omni b i h it means omni bihora and bihora it means a bihora or bihora omni bihora it means a every two hours then omni hora it means every one hour or md hour O N Omni Nocte it means every night and OPD it means once per day. Let's check the next one. So first one is ask many time. It is S O S it means C opus sit. C opus sit it means is there is a need or if necessary is there if unnecessary. Or is there is a need so SOS means C low opus sit next one is a TID it is a turindi T means tur I means ein and D means di turindi three times a a next one is the SID it means simel in di it's a once a day next one is the QID it means quarter in a di now four times a day pc it means possibum it is a after meals so these five are a very important ask many time in a competitive exam so must revise this one okay let's check the next okay friends thank you uh, for this video and like share and subscribe our channel for such more educational videos if you want the study materials related to the GPAT, Hyper, Drug Inspector and Pharmacist exam, you may call or WhatsApp us on 9016312020.